So I'm just going to stand back and watch to see if anyone starts, you know, getting into a fight. I'm pretty sure that's what happened last time. And there was money being stolen and I was picking it up, you know, scrounging around on the ground on my hands and knees, picking up all the money that was falling as a result of the physical violence that was taking place on the train. It was quite an experience. What is going on? We're going to crash into these buildings, man. Who is controlling this thing? <laughs> now that I say that, it, there's no one controlling it, so I guess the, the AI is fucking up. Well, the AI likes to live dangerously. Oh, it looks like that is the place we're going to enter. It looks very much like a monorail sort of entrance. Shuttle control lever. Autopilot. Express bound for Royal Library. Can I just shut off the autopilot? I bet I can with my bearer powers. Anyway. Oh, look out. Looks like we just fucking went uh, to light speed. Shuttle Platform 3. This looks very much like where I was before. Is it just me or is this exactly where I was before? What do you have to say for yourself now? Watch out for wild oxen. If I read that one more fucking time, everyone's gonna die, alright? Yuma News. You obtained the new issue of Yuma News and I destroyed all of the other issues because only I deserve to read it. Hello, I don't remember you selling something last time. Hand strap. Handy strap for train passengers. No stealing from the train. What? Whatever. <laughs> I really don't even know where to begin with that. Is this where I was before? No, it's not. It, everything just looks the fucking same. Good to know. Is there a save point? What is going on? God, it's like a black guy just walked into a southern pub. Okay, now... What's... Okay. I'm really confused. Did you communicate anything to me? No running, Koopa. Oh, Jesus. Treasure chest, here we go. Can I just steal this? Is that allowed? Hold on, I'm gonna throw it. I wanna throw it! Okay, oh, I'm running. We need to walk in the library. I never really thought about the fact that I was running, but I guess I am. This Moogle has something to say. Where is Kais, anyway? Whatever, what do you have to say? You are a well-behaved young man. Well, that's not what I... <laughs> this is not the kind of, uh indication I got from you guys when I walked in before, or rather ran in before. Best behavior discovered. Oh, look out. Okay. Now, I didn't know that there was such a rule as no running in the library, but now we have learned that there is such a rule. That is fine. Is this running? Uh-oh. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. No running, Kupo. I'm sorry. What do you have to say? Where is Kai's? Look for the guy who's basically Axel Rose's look-alike. I know I'm well behaved, thank you. But I thought I was here for a reason, and that was not to just walk around and be told that I'm well behaved. Where is Kais? What does he have to say? I'm, I'm pretty sure- oh, hold on, accessories, I probably should be equipping these things. Do I have none? What the fuck? Anyway, so, urgent. So, yeah, I don't know. I have not really been given an update. I was given a shuttle to take me to the Royal Library. Which would indicate to me... Or maybe I need to just continue over there. I just thought that we were now in the library, but maybe we're not. Oh, we don't want to run. Green... Greenery entrance. Well, this is obviously not the frickin' library. That's the greenery. So why is there nothing going on in here? What am I missing? Do I need to talk to the desk clerk? There is... There isn't one. Okay, time to open some treasure chests. Ow. Let's throw that. Hope you guys don't mind. Oh, what? Okay, let's throw it at a wall. That's fine. There we go. What's inside? I'm running. Can't stop me. You found an antique. What's the point of having an antique in the library? On display, but inside a treasure chest so no one can see it. Do you mind me stealing your antiques, by the way? No running, Kupo. I'm trying not to. I just don't know if these things disappear over time. My first tableware. What, am I going to make a fucking house? Or build a house? Or, you know, furnish a house? However I'm trying to communicate this. What is that over there? Looks like a retarded, um... I'm not running! Well, I'm, I technically am. I'm more like jogging, but... I can run faster, believe me. I can't take this. What, what is What is this? Climb with A? Hey, let's do it. Excellent. Let's go throw this at the wall. This is going on for a little longer than I... Uh, stuffed specimen. 
like taxidermy or just a stuffed animal? Or as in like a toy, I don't know. If they say specimen, I can only assume that they mean like taxidermy, but... Oh, there's a, there's a platform over there. Okay, relax everyone. I'm not running, leave me alone! Fuck you! There's some sparkly things over here, let's go and see what's going on. Okay, is that money? What? What's going on? They've hidden, they've actually hid money bags in the wall. This is, what? Fire book, okay. Okay, so I can throw the fire book and light something on fire, good to know. Why do I have to lift it up to get the money? Stop! Yeah, so the Moogle has no problem with me looting. It's just when I'm running, that's the problem. Alright, I'm about to be taken up to the mothership. I'm trying to- okay, I would have been able to get on it just fine if I were allowed to run, but I'm not. What the fuck is going on in this game? And I'm being told not to run after all of that. Well, you know what? You have just caused me to be highly inconvenienced. Alright, get on it now. Holy shit. Alright, go. Why did it... Why is it that it goes when I don't want it to go? And when I want it to go, it doesn't go. Let's say go a few more times. More money. What is going on? You... Oh. I thought I was about to get in trouble for looting, finally. Another fire book. Who am I throwing this at? Oh, God. I would apologize, but I really don't care. That was more funny than anything. Um, okay, so I think, is there a higher level than this? Yes, there is. So we'll get on the thing soon. I just want to, you know, go through all the bookshelves here. I really didn't want this video to go for so long, but maybe it'll end up being long enough for three videos in total, because this is still the same recording that I did for part nine, so... Although I did officially split it up. Okay, I think I can run as much as I fucking want up here. Let's just do it. There's no one enforcing the rule. So fuck all of you. I can finally move as I was born to move. Alright, so the elevator thing should be coming down. Okay, drop on it. And we want to continue up. So get going whenever you, whenever you can, whenever you want to. Come on. Kais must be up here, and if he is up here, he's being a real dickhead, because he's made me go way too far for this. He's not even up here. What is going on? I was told to come to the Royal Library. There's no one here. What? Like, I don't understand. Ow. Throw it at the wall. Treasure chest. What's inside? Lots of money. That is what I like to see. Look at that. All those gold coins. That's what did it. What's with all the fire books? These are not helpful for me. It's not like I can take them with me and use them later on. So what the hell am I going to do with a fire book in this place? There's no, there are no enemies that I need to fight. Unless I'm supposed to do something with a fire book in this location. It's possible. That would actually make a lot of sense. So let's take a fire book with us. And, what the? This is not what I wanted in life. Oh, I'm about to be told not to run. I'm sorry. No running. Yeah, whatever. Let's go grab a fire book, and um, yes, so maybe we need to throw this at something in this location to actually initiate some sort of something. Oh, why is this happening? Just go down, please. I suppose it can't know what I really want to do, but, oh, Jesus. Just, okay, whatever. I may actually have to check a walkthrough to see what the hell I'm supposed to do. Maybe, okay, maybe we want to continue into the garden after all. We have established that there's nothing here, and I don't think I need to throw a firebook at anything, so, y you know, okay, who's going to get hit by it? Anyone? No one. Oh, fuck off. I'm getting out of here now. Just, just leave me up. Really, Kais was here the whole time? He told me to go to the library, so I was looking for him in the library. This is not the library, this is the garden. Stupid game. Nice. Oh, aren't you? From this time what? Forward, refer to me as Colonel Kais. Why are you still allowed to wear that stupid You're thing on your head? In the Royal Army? You're a Selkie. A symbolic gesture of tribal unity. Apparently, the Lilties were thrilled to have me enlist. On top Obviously, they don't make you cut your hair when you're in the military here. I'm a colonel. You know, by golly, he's gonna punch you. Seriously. He and I right. Have different worlds. What good is there in hating all things Lilties? So, about the letter? 
second crystal idol, I have a good idea of where Oh, that story related stuff that I know nothing about. Nor I do I give a damn. I have no new information. This thing is no different from any other shard, besides the color. What we need then is by golly's assistance on this matter. How do we go with him anyway? Did he try to push some job on you? I told him that I would introduce him to a crystal reactor alternative. Yeah, but that wilty heater would never use an engine designed by Sid. Anyway, I'll go and deal with by golly. You go and talk to Sid. Are you sure about this? Are you fucking serious? Oh, I came all this way just to go to back and talk to Sid. Here. I feel like I just came from Sid. Hey, Lael. The Lilty say their prosperity was promised to them by their tribal crystal. What do you think? Do you believe it? The Clavat will always be poor. Crystal or no crystal. Makes Ouch. no difference. Okay. But then what are those crystals? They say they preside over the destiny of each tribe and form the principle of the world. But it's just a myth. Well then, what do you think crystal bearers are? Agents of the light, or children of the dark. In reality, we're neither. Nothing special. It's unlike you to talk about yourself that way, Lael. You made me say it, Colonel. Pondering your own existence is a waste of time. Do we really have to start calling him Colonel? And why was he given such a high rank immediately? What is going on? Anyway, so le let's move on. So we actually just needed to go to the greenery entrance, good to know. And uh, I'm rolling and none of you can stop me. I've left the library, you cannot chase me. You cannot chase me. Are you really going to chase me out of the library? No, you're not. No, you're not. Look at, look at this. He's chasing me out of the library to tell me not to run the library. This is hilarious. Look at this. He's going to follow me onto the train to tell me not to run in the library. I'm out of here. I'm out of here. He's not talking to me. Go. No. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah, come on. Get over here. You're coming on the train with me, my friend. <laughs> oh, I think I just saw that Moogle get pushed around pretty hardcore as well. Oh my god, this Moogle is... I feel sorry for it now, but it's still a little funny. Is it on the train with me? Where is it? Oh, I think it just got removed. That's a shame, but... Oh, that was really funny. I thought I was going to just pretty much kidnap the thing. Oh my god. Very entertaining. So I don't really know where we're going now. I'm guessing back the way we came because we need to go all the way to Sid. I do not know how to get to Sid, actually. But for now, I'm just going to, I, I guess, find a save point. I don't know. Or then again, we're definitely into part 11 right now. So I guess I'm just going to continue recording here until I've got enough for what would end up being part 11, so, yeah. Oh, look out, someone's on fire. No fires in the train, please. There were actually three people on fire, for the love of God. Can you not fucking rob me? I'm not the sort of person that you want to rob, I can assure you. I can fucking destroy every single one of you in this fucking train. So last time there was no physical disagreement, but now there is. Maybe I'm entering a bad part of town. I don't know. Alright, so here we are. We're somewhere. We need to go to Sid. You are very well dressed. What is the what does it go with you? You're like a main character. Little King? Yeah, I was gonna say, like. Can I interact with you at all? Like I feel that, like you need to be spoken to. Unless you're some sort of cameo from another Final Fantasy game. Anyway, whatever. Maybe it is a cameo. Regardless. We're going back, we are actually backtracking all the way to this place. Now, didn't we, I'm trying to go back in my mind to when we were last here in this location. We took some path to get to, oh that's right, I remember we, we had to escape this place. But, um, I don't know how to get to Vi, not Vigali, sorry, uh, we want to go to Sid. I don't know how to get to his place. I really haven't a clue because he is really far away from where we are right now. Unless we can check the map. Where's the map? Is there a map? If I press 2, we'll end up taking a screenshot, so I won't do that. I'm actually a little lost as to what I need to do right now. I'm going to be honest. Um, 
Stiltskin, do you have any words of wisdom? Greetings once again. You can't use the Selkie train, so you have to walk to Bridgetown. First exit the capital and head south toward Cherry Checkpoint. I see. I had actually forgotten that that was a place we could go. I cannot believe we have to do this manually, but whatever. What a game that I'm playing right now. I've got no idea how long this is going to continue for, by the way. Realistically, I am only at part 11 for this Let's Play, so therefore, it's probably going to go until maybe part 25, part 30. So I think we still have probably about another 50% of the game to get through, which I'm not very excited about. No, I'm not a huge fan of this game. I'm not sure if any of you watching are huge fans of this game, but I'd like to think that if you've gotten as far as part 11, you've probably become too offended to watch me by now because I do nothing but rip on this game. So, yeah, I my condolences to anyone who's sticking around who really likes this game, but... Or maybe you like the game but can still find it entertaining to have me talk shit about it. I don't know, but... Yeah. Maybe I don't do it intelligently, so I just make myself out to look like an idiot, I'm not sure, but regardless, let's go and head to Cherry Checkpoint. I'm not going to cut, because I think I need to drag out the video anyway. So let's just, yeah, you jump at the door, guy. Honestly, I would be able to open the door better than you, because I actually have magical powers that can open doors, whereas you're just jumping around like an idiot. Alright, let's, uh, for actually no real reason whatsoever, jump from place to place here. Maybe it is faster to do this. I never really considered it. And then, that's it. Did you have fun, guys? I hope you did. This is our creation here, once again, and I... I don't know how I feel about it. I don't really feel anything. I'm very neutral towards it. Anyway, we're gonna head to Cherry Checkpoint. And I have the feeling that once we get to wherever we... Wherever we need to go after Cherry Checkpoint, we will save and finish. I'm tempted to save there and finish, but again, I'm not entirely sure if I have enough for part 11, so I'm just going to continue. You have to keep in mind that I did disappear to do something, so I'm not entirely sure how much time I spent doing that. But anyway. Bring the engine to Grassland Station. Is it Vigali or Valgali? I think it's Vigali. I think so, yeah it is. It's just because it's so low res, it's hard to... Like, there's almost no gap between the, the dot of the eye and the main structure of the eye letter, but anyway. Vigali is heading for the capital. Don't ask me how I did it. All you need to know is that he's on his way. Now you have to find Sid in Bridgetown and get him to bring his steam engine to Grassland Station. Take a chocobo if there are any around. It's way faster well. than walking. Okay. Well, I would be happy to do that, except that I... I really don't know if there will be a chocobo around. We're going to go to Cherry Checkpoint and just hope that there's a save point. If there isn't, then I may very well, off camera, return to the save point over there. And then, when I return in part 12, I will go ahead and just pick up exactly where I had left off on camera before. Now, we should have killed all the enemies here. It's looking like we have. And now there are people hanging around here. Well, isn't that just lovely? Hey, look, something's being built here in this time. Incredible. You look like you're poisoned or something, because you're glowing purple. What do you want? Oh, never mind. I don't think he's being... Oh, he is being angry. Here, I'll give you this, so go away. Thank you. Why is such a cute creature being so aggressive? You again? Please be quiet. Okay, well, I'm not going to rob you of all, all of your money, but I, I will actually, because I'm assuming this is your money as well. Or maybe it's not money inside. Can you just throw the goddamn thing, you stupid bearer? Okay. What's inside? Money! That's probably all your money. And now you are broke. I'm sorry. Oh, is it another Leo? It's another Leo. Is it the same Leo? Or are there multiple people walking around named Leo, dressed in the same outfit and with the same hair and appearance? I really don't know. The postal Moogle, or the Moogle from the postal service, is again trying to bother me. Oh, wow. I was expecting wild oxen. It's about time we got something different. Rescue flares spotted. When you see a rescue flare go up in the snowfields, go out and rescue whoever is out there immediately. But don't get stranded out there yourself. Well, that's all well and good to say, isn't it? Anyway. So, Stiltskin's over here. We'll see what he has to say. And we meet again. The Chocobo Circuit lies beyond this gate. Follow the cliff to the Old Let Aqueduct. I think you know the way to, the, to Bridgetown from there, right? I recommend you go by Chocobo. Okay, everyone's recommending that I do that, so I will do that. 
but by the sounds of it, I don't have to do that. So if I really loved walking in this game, I could do that if I wanted. Okay, let's read the Yuma News. I don't know, materials, inbox, newspapers. Oh, Yuma News is its own thing. Uh, what have we got? Report, the Valley of Death. Racers beware. There is a valley just beyond the Chocobo... Oh, <laughs> there is a valley... There's a valley just beyond the Chocobo Circuit that reeks of death. A place seemingly void of the protective light of the crystal. Here, Chocobo racers and... Oh, rather, here, Chocobo racers and fans have reported many monster sightings. One oft-seen monster is the Trick Face. What? Whose <laughs> vast wings sprout from its giant face. That's... What? So, I'm just imagining this thing with giant... Oh. I should be reading all these human news things. I'm like, a tongue? Who the hell is giving tongues, like actual tongues, out with a fucking news magazine or a newsletter? That's disgusting. What's wrong with these people? Do I have a save point or do I have to get on a chocobo and start writing it around? Oh my god. I am not recording 12 bars. That is not happening. All right, fine. Where are the chocobos? This is the chocobo circuit. I'm not seeing any chocobos. Okay, I, I think I need to take the chocobo to some location. I don't know. Oh my god, this is getting annoying already. Can I press A to get over there? Yes, I can. What's happening? Where are the chocobos? Did they all get killed or what? Is it because there are enemies in this area? Probably. Because as you can see, there's one of those things again. Alright, so I'm actually going to do what I said that I was going to do as far as um, going back to that save point from before and all of that business. So actually, maybe I have an autosave that's around here somewhere, but I don't trust the autosave. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to disappear and I will see you guys in part 12. We will be at the same spot or roughly the same spot and you don't really need to worry about the process that I undertake to save the game. So anyway, I'll see you next time. It is once again the 26th of March 2020, and this should be part 11 that you're watching. Anyway, I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.